guys. It is Sunday evening and I decided I wanted to go ahead and do a changing video with my new baby. She's very sweet. She's precious. I adore her. She's very peaceful. I just love her peaceful expression. I think she's fantastic. I really am enjoying her. So I'm going to just change her into an outfit. Even though it's late, I decided I wanted to put an outfit on her for the week because I probably won't get a chance to um, change her much or mess with her during the week because my weeks are very busy. Um, so I figured now would be a good time to quickly change her and kind of chit chat with you guys a little bit. And I will do a details video of her so you guys can see all of her beautiful details. She's so sweet. She really is um, made beautifully. I love her features. I love her little hands and feet. Her ears are amazing. Uh, I'm really just, I'm really thrilled with her. And because she's poured by Claire, I know she's made with the best silicone. It's just, it's wonderful. So, very happy with her. So, I also have news I wanted to share about her. I mentioned in my previous video that I was hoping to get her rooted by a specific artist and I am so excited to share with you guys that she will indeed be getting rooted by the artist I wanted to have root her that I didn't want to put on the spot by mentioning her in a video. But now since I have talked to her and I have commissioned her to go ahead and root her um, towards the end of the month. Um, so it'll be Jackie Ortiz who is going to be rooting this sweet baby for me. I'm so excited. I think that um, adding the right kind of hair will soften her features and I think that it will really make her more feminine looking. And I'm just, I cannot even tell you how excited I am. And Jackie's work is just absolutely amazing. She's so talented and I'm thrilled to be able to have a baby rooted by her. <laughs> So she'll be sent off um, after they move. I know they're going to be moving in the next week or so. So when they're done moving, that's when we will go ahead and ship her off. And then she will grow hair. <laughs> so I'm kind of uh, want her to look absolutely newborn, of course, because she is a newborn. So we want I want her to look... Um, Newborn yet girly and dainty and all of those things. So I think um, Jackie's style of rooting will be just that and it'll be perfect for her. I can't wait to see what she's going to look like with beautifully rooted hair because I've yet to see any of this edition of any of these babies done um, with rooted, rooted hair. They're always left bald, which they're cute bald, but I'm just, I'm not a big baldy Fan, I guess it's not that she that I don't like how she looks bald. I just prefer babies with hair because my baby's always had hair, so I feel like that's probably why I'd prefer every doll I have to have hair. <laughs> Does that make sense? So yeah. Oh, and I'm putting on her this really cute um, Jacati outfit. So cute. I got it when um, I was in New York City, and. Tina and I had sought out finding <laughs> Jacati stores throughout New York City. And as all of you may already know from, you know, many of my videos, I'm a huge Jacati fan. I like their clothing. Um, it's my favorite store. It's very expensive though, so I have to kind of pick and choose what I buy there and a lot of times I buy when things are on sale so you can get them highly discounted which is fantastic. So this outfit is really super cute. I like the little collar that looks like a little flower. <laughs> I find that to be very cute. And it's been cold here. Um, yesterday it was miserable but today it's, it's it was a nice day. It was actually um, it was sunny today and, and a lot warmer than it was yesterday, but yesterday it was raining. Oh, it's like I couldn't get warm all day because it was just so cold and wet and rainy. And when it's cold out and wet, 
I don't know about you guys, but I just, I never can feel warm enough. <laughs> and I had like a, a wedding reception, um, party gathering, whatever you want to call it yesterday evening. And it was out in an area that it was kind of like a, a log. It's like almost like a cabin. And the way it was set up is it's, they don't have like a bunch of heat turned on yet. And so they had the fireplace going, but it was really chilly because it was cold yesterday. Like, super cold because of it being, you know, rainy and such. So I froze. I spent most of the time sitting in front of the fire trying to soak up all the warmth that I could get from it. <laughs> and so by the time we got home, I was like bundled up with sweaters galore and climbed into bed because I was so cold. <laughs> but yeah, it's just, I'm not a fan of the weather to come. I think I've already explained this to like everybody in my world. They all know that I am not a winter weather fan whatsoever, <laughs> but I have to prepare myself because it's coming. So hence why I'm dressing baby in warm clothes because it's happening whether I want it to or not. <laughs> so I'm putting on her little pair of Ducati little leather shoes to go with this outfit. I think these are so cute. Um, they're teeny tiny. They're like such a tiny little size. And I've never been able to find these anywhere that were small enough. So now I'm glad that I did pick them up. These I also bought in New York City. You'll see it on a haul way back when. Um, I'm glad that I picked them up and I found them because now I have babies that can wear them because they're very hard, you know, little babies, newborn size babies with newborn size baby feet, especially reborns and silicones their feet tend to be small <laughs> in general most of my baby's feet are small occasionally get one that has big feet but most of the time that's not the case and this is just an outfit that I think looks so cute with the little shoes on love love and we want her to be warm of course <laughs> not that I think she won't be but I love this I love the ruffles and the little collar and everything else I love this little outfit on her. It's a little big because she's um, she's a newborn size and this is a zero to one month size. And I think that it fits her okay. It's because she has bent legs that it looks like it's big on her. But if her legs were straight, it would probably fit her better. But she has bent legs because she's a newborn baby and they just have their legs all curled up. Oh, this looks so cute and so warm and toasty. And we'll take this hat off of her and we'll put, I think this hat will be nice. Yeah, it'll match. This is um, from Next. It's a Next hat that looks like it'll be cute. It's just a little knitted pink hat that I think would be, thought might be cute with this outfit. Yes, I tend to put hats on. I'll be putting hats on her probably until she gets rooted. Just because, well, I don't know. It depends, I guess, on what she's wearing. But I always feel like her head looks like it's going to be cold. <laughs> so that's why I want to keep it warm because it's so chilly here. I think that's why I'm just so, I don't know. I guess I, I, I don't know. I, I like to keep her covered <laughs> like she would be warm. But I will have to do a details video because let me tell you, this baby's hands and features are just so pretty, so delicate, so pretty. I just love her. <laughs> this looks like it's draped open on you. But there you go, guys. Here, I'll set her up so you can see. And her little <laughs> Ducati, the little collar. So cute. And it's like a little checkered um, outfit. I think it's adorable on her. And she's just looking so peacefully. She's still sleeping with these little dainty hands. Just love her. She's such a cuddle bug. She's just so lovely to hold. I'm really enjoying her. She's a great size. Like I said, I think that for me, um, the perfect size baby, especially in a full body silicone, is a newborn size, like around 19 inches is a good size because then they're not too heavy and they curl right up in your arms. 
And she is exactly that. She's not too heavy. She curls right up in your arms when you pick her up and she's just utterly adorable. And she just looks so peaceful. So there you go, guys. There's my baby girl. I still haven't named her yet. Still haven't named her yet. So I'm still pondering names. Um, I know you guys have been throwing out some good suggestions, but I will keep thinking about it and I will let you know I've been, I was pondering the, the name Isabel. That's a pretty girly name. I'm not sure though if that's what I'll end up keeping. I don't know. I'm kind of playing around. I want a special name for her. I think she deserves a special name. Not that none of my, my other previous babies or other babies have had special names. I just, I always like to have a suitable name, one that fits. And I haven't come up with one that really stands out other than I like Isabel. So you guys will have to let me know what you think about having her name be Isabel. But yeah, there she is in her pretty little outfit. Looking at her so cute. All right, guys. Well, I hope everybody's having a great evening. Um, I'm going to go watch my Sunday evening favorite shows because I have the new premieres of um, I Love the Good Wife. It's like my favorite show that's premiering tonight. And let's see. Um, what else? Uh, Madam Secretary. That's another one. I don't know. All, I'm so glad all the shows are back on. So one thing I like about fall is that all the shows come back on. And I'm always so yay. Because I always leave off with... You look like leaving with a cliffhanger, so I'm looking forward to catching up on all of them. So, anyways, guys, enjoy the rest of your evening, and uh, we will see you all soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.